Good day friends, it is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another 3D printing video, so let's get cracking. Friends, we're starting on my website, 3D Printers tab, Artillery X4 Pro. Once there, we need to go to the website. When it launches, slide out to support and switch to downloads. We are talking about the X4 Pro. Just a quick reminder, you've got your manual. Yesterday, we updated the firmware, and if you check out the slicing software, there is a new version, 3.02, came out on 2.23. I'm going to download that as well. A simple click of the download button. I'm going to save it to my downloads. There is the old 3.0 from a day ago. Maybe I should delete a few things. Let's bring up Explorer, and of course, double-click to install. Notice we do have to click more info and we need to run anyway. Tell it yes and next and install to get the software added. Once that was complete, I could hit finish and it's time to launch. Notice now it's version 3.02 and everything so far is the same. Friends, today we're going to do a Wi-Fi print. Let me take you over to the printer and show you how to get that going. So friends, in our interface, of course I have upgraded that firmware to the February 23rd version. We're going to go to set, and today you want to set up your network. Now as you can see, mine is already connected. All I did was click on one of my HLMT networks, it pops up a screen, and then you simply use a tiny keyboard to put in your network information. Once you've got this IP address, it's time to go back to the computer, and friends, let me show you how to print via Wi-Fi. All right, so let's start by adding an object. I have got a super fun lizard. You can see I'm on version 7. This was designed by one of my students, and of course there's a tutorial that shows you how to make it. When you are done printing it, it can be a keychain, and you can fill the eyeballs with some filament. So we've got our item, and we're going to take it, and instead of just slicing it and putting it on a disc, we are going to add it to a physical printer. You can see right here I made this printer, so I'm going to show you how I did it. It was add printers, and I want to add a physical printer. Now we must give it a name, Pro, and I'll put a 2 after it, just because I've already made it. The host is going to be Octoprint, and we need to type that number that was on the screen. Now ours will all be different. Mine was 192.168.6.194, and if we hit test, bingo, it's connected. You can type anything here. I'm just going to put a couple of ones and tell it OK. And then our new printer is built. Now for this lizard, I'm going to stay with the 5%. I do not want any brim. I'm going to use PLA, which is what's on the printer. And I'm going to hit Slice Now. Now before I send it to the printer, I am going to launch a brand new tab. And we're going to type in that IP address, 192.168. Dot six dot one ninety four. Note yours will be different. Just like that, we have got access to our printer. You can see the things that I have printed so far. You can tell how long they printed. You've got all your temperatures. You've got tools that you can adjust your speed, your flow, pressure advance, smooth time. We could have macros, fans. There are so many items. Friends, I will keep exploring this and I'll share more as we play. But if I return back, and I choose my X4 Pro. I'm going to go with the one I built yesterday. Once again, double checking. I've got my PLA 5% no brim. Now I can click this little arrow and I can send it to the printer. I'm just going to keep the name, choose upload and print. Notice it shows completed here. Let's quickly minimize this and notice back at the web page, it states that it's printing. Of course, we'll be able to check this out in just a little bit. You can see there are the temperatures heating. But friends, right there you have it. Simple steps to send a print via Wi-Fi using the Artillery X4 Pro.
friends I'm gonna shut off the printer because it makes it quieter and after 26 minutes we've got an awesome little lizard once again you can take off your bed I've got these straight now uh, I have got it calibrated right now so well that it just comes off that easily. Friends, this is a Tinkercad design. It is a ton of fun. Of course, I'll make sure there's a link to it as well, but that is how you print using Wi-Fi and the awesome X4 Pro from Artillery. First Clipper Wi-Fi print was pretty darn epic. Friends, as I wrap up, I do want to remind you once again about my website, hlmodtech.com. Of course, I have got a tab about Tinkercad with tons of awesome tutorials. You'll also find the awesome 3D printer page with information about all the printers that I've worked with. Finally, friends, if you look down in the bottom corner, there is a sweet built-in message until you can click that button, add your question, comment, or suggestion, and reach me almost instantly. Lastly, friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about AHL Mod Tech. Don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.